guess I'm just gonna buy those for now. Nope. Doesn't look like I'm gonna have to probably spend a whole bunch of money at that. Before I can actually get uh, any kind of friendship. We don't know who's over here either. I say I don't like doing side content, and now I'm currently, like, doing so obsessively. Sup? Hmm? There's something up there. What? Is that a person? Kind of hard to tell from down here. I'm gonna let the pigeon spread its wings. Aha! I knew that was a person. But why is he dressed up like a ninja? Uh -huh. So you've discovered me at last! Ah. Oh man, that guy just ate shit. Maybe I should check in on him. How impressive! For one who's seen past my chameleon camouflage and lived to tell the tale! Mm -hmm. Alas! Forgive my rudeness, I'm known as Ryan Acosta, number one ninja beneath the rising sun. Believe it! Oh, boy. Allow me to ask thy name! Yagami. Then I should call you Master Yagami, a fitting title for a man such a, uh, such high caliber. However, this will not happen the next time. Believe it! And now, I take my leave. Farewell! What the hell was that? Alright, that was worth it. I apologize if that voice gets on your nerves, but it was the only one I could think of. Well, I've been screwing around enough. Do, do we have any more? One more popo. Because I got that one. Oh! The one I'm missing is actually the one at the office. That makes it easy. But no, this side content really does make this game feel quite nice. Uh, quite nice, quite alive. I guess was the phrase that had been used, but like, I don't know. It is, it is pretty fun. Sup? Give me a second. Must grab my primary armaments, as is my usual. Now, unfortunately, I need them to, like, really line up a little bit here. Unfortunately, that bike is done so. But that's okay. Because, honestly... What the... What? Why did that... Why did any... Why did... My sign of justice and destruction. Thank you. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> Why are you hiding over there? <laughs> really, guys? <laughs> I love just the lackadaisical toss. Whack. Okay, uh, let's see. How many skill points am I? Wow, I'm rocking a lot. Uh, I could do combo speed. Could do attack. I think I'm going to do boost health. Because these enemies are starting to hit hard. They don't have that much HP. But still. So I got to learn flux fissure for this one. I have no idea how I'm even going to use that, but that's fine. Hold down square after a rush combo. Oh! So square, 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 square. And then hold square. That's, a, that's how it works. Uh, that shouldn't be too hard. 
And unfortunately, Phoenix Wright is Capcom, isn't it? Yeah, damn. That makes me sad. Huh. I wonder if the Yakuza games are actually one of the more successful Sega titles at this point. I'm always a little bit surprised at how many IPs Sega still manages to have under their belt. Hello, sir. I'd like to buy your finest everything. Hmm? Sure, why not? What's this about? Blah, 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 blah. We should know about this. Okay, so we s we're still maxed out on Odin. Are we? No, no, no. I ate a bunch. I had pork tonkatsu the other day. It was good. Thank you for stopping by with today's purchase. Ba ba ba. And we get the we get the friendship thing. City reputation goes up. Ten point total. Blah 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 blah. Oh, no. I don't know. I guess I'm always just a little bit baffled that Sega's like mainliner that everybody knows about Sonic is just like kind of the pit series and an utter joke for them. But that's okay. Because all their other games are actually pretty good. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, your Shintani sensei not here? Beats me. What do you need him for? I just wanted to ask him about something. I'll try back later. Hold on a sec. Hmm? Yagami. You plan on twiddling your thumbs until Shintani comes back? Uh, are you busy? Well, I can't say I'm busy. Good. Then I got the perfect job for you. I have a, I have a client who needs a bodyguard, and I need you to fill the po- I want you to fill the post, mm -hmm. Yagami. A bodyguard? What kind of clients are you taking these days? Oh. It's just a messy custody battle that's going to court. I'm representing the mother. Names... Azusa Otaki, and the daughter's name is Karen. They're set to appear in a domestic affairs court today, and I'd like you to protect them until they get there. Who do they need protection from? Apparently the father was Yakuza until very recently. The way she tells it, she got into a huge fight with him and had to flee with her daughter. So you're giving her a bodyguard just because he's ex-Yakuza? Isn't that kind of an overreaction? This poor woman doesn't seem to think so. Said her husband would do anything to get his daughter back. Razun's name is Jin Otaki. Might not even come to it, but you can. Uh, but can you protect them from him if it does? Yep. All right. Seems pretty clear. Who knows when Shintani Sensei will be back anyway? So I guess Thank I'll help. You. Sorry, I'll pay you. By the way, ever heard of Shunei Oki uh, Oikawa? Uh, I Oikai o Oikawa? The lawyer. Mm -hmm. Oikawa? No. Don't think I have. He's representing the father, but he's formerly one of mine. Huh? He worked here? Yeah. Yeah. He was gone before you started. One of those elite types who passed the bar real early in life. I'm sinking in my chair and it's a problem. Not that big of a problem, but it makes it really hard to use my controller. Or, well, just commentate? I don't know. It was gone before he started. Okay, yeah, we already read that. But he wanted to win this case by any means necessary, even bribery or back blackmail. Yeah, I'm surprised I haven't heard of him then. He was good, had some real potential. That's why I came down hard on him about changing his ways, but he didn't give a damn. In the end, I had no choice. I fired him. Maybe I thought that would be the wake up call he needed. But all it did was give him a chip on his shoulder. I swear, the man only lives to beat me now. Hmm. Out of revenge for firing him or something? Yeah. yeah. Living for revenge just makes you sloppy. Probably never learn. Anyway, do you know where this mother and her daughter are now? They were here not long ago, actually. She said they had some shopping to do. I couldn't stop her. <sighs> Being her legal counsel, counsel, she doesn't seem to want to take my advice. Hmm. Sounds like a lovely family. Any idea where they might have gone? You said something about getting some clothes to make themselves presentable in court. Somewhere with clothes, huh? Alright, I'll go find her.
Let's see, why do they voice some of the lines and not others? Uh, all main missions are voice acted, all side missions are not. Pretty easy division. Uh, I prefer this as opposed to kind of doing it randomly. Normally, I would actually add flair to the voice acting in this one, but... Honestly, I think that's that's something I'd rather mess around with in a goofier game. The more serious the tone, generally, the more I'll just take it straight. Phoenix Wright, on the other hand, oh boy, you better bet I'm just going to editorialize everything. That is money I left behind from earlier. Not a wise choice. Not a wise choice indeed. Ooh, look, Mega Sign! Mega Sign! God, getting hit by that. Excuse me, you coming? There you go. Yep, sure, buddy. Whatever you say. <laughs> what a waste. So we're going back to that super expensive clothing store, aren't we? Yeah, we are. Let's see, this isn't silly? It sort of is? I mean... It varies. No, that's a good point. This game can be really silly, like that stupid ninja. I don't know. I guess it's kind of one of those where it's like... It really does... Kind of depend on... On what the exact, uh... Circumstances are. Ooh. Collectibles. And a club! Want to play catch, dude? Catch. Catch. God. Do you, like, not have any family to do stuff with? Well, screwed that one up. Uh... Like, seriously, what was your childhood like? Have you never played catch ever? Man, look. One, one last try. Catch. And stay huh. down. Well, I can safely say you have no career in baseball. Maybe rugby. If only to slow the other players down. Definitely not baseball though. But yeah, I don't I don't know how to describe this, but like I don't feel like I have room to goof goof around with the dialogue in this game, nor do I need to. Is the wife I'm supposed to be protecting here? Ah. Oh, that must be her. Excuse me. Excuse me, ma'am. Are you Azusa Otaki? Mm. Sorry, Otaki? I am. Who are you? I'm Yagami. Yenda sensei asked me to look after you today. Oh, Yagami san. Yes. Yenda sensei did mention you. Well, nice to meet you. Hmm. Is your daughter around? Mm -hmm. Karen? You didn't see her? No. No, I didn't. Mm -hmm. Really? She was here just a second ago. I got so focused on the clothes, I guess I didn't realize. Is she lost? That's not good. She's an easy target for the husband if she's alone. But what should I do? Be a better parent? I'll go look for her. Stay here, just in case she comes back. Uh, uh, okay. Maybe someone around here saw something. I should ask around. Welcome Welcome back. Always a pleasure to have you, sir. Huh? You actually remembered me? But of course! I remember all the names and faces of my valued customers. All the policy of mine. Hey, that's classy. I like it. Thank you. Please let me know if there's anything I can help you with. My name is Nautaro Te Terahara. This is Yagami. I appreciate that. I'm Yagami, by the way. Then let me ask you, Yagami-san, would you be interested in a custom-tailored mm -hmm. suit? Huh. Well, that actually would be nice. Mm. I don't really dress formal anymore. <laughs> Is that so? I personally think you'd look quite handsome in a properly fitted suit. <laughs> you sure you're not just buttering me up? Oh, no, sir. My compliments are 100% butter-free. I pride myself in making every suit unique to match the customer's needs. So if you ever feel the need to spiff up your overall appearance, be more than happy to assist you. Well then, 
Whenever I need a suit, I'll come here looking for you. Excellent. Then I'll be waiting your visit. I'm a little bit disappointed you can't change uh, Yagami's outfit. Like, I realize that there's the disguises, but they really kind of missed the opportunity to have, like, a bunch of alt costumes for him that you could dress him up in. Just because, like, yeah, I'd absolutely uh, put Yagami in, like, a pig mask if I had to. Okay, so we're looking for this lady. Excuse me. Excuse me. Have you seen this child? I can't seem to find her. Huh? Oh, I think I saw her earlier. You did? Yeah, she was strolling towards Nakamichi Street. Toward Nakamichi sh Street, thank you. Like, that is one thing I really enjoyed about uh, Sleeping Dogs, is that there was actually a shocking amount of character, like, visual customization you could do. Oh. Hi. I guess I should probably actually learn how to fight. I should probably actually learn how to fight people. The problem is, they're not very durable. What a waste. So it's kind of hard. Is that a manhole cover? Oh, I thought that was cash. I got excited. Hello, child. Her. She looks like Karen Chan in the photo. You're Karen Otaki, aren't you? Who are you, mister? My name's Yagami. Genda sensei hired me to look after you and your mother. She lost track of you. So mom suddenly cares about me. I'm big enough to do what I want. Leave me alone. Uh, I can't do that. If mom and dad want to get divorced, fine. I wish I could just go live by myself. Hmm. Is she really that nonchalant about the divorce? What? Karen, what are you doing here? Oh, Daddy, I was looking for you. You were? You sure? You're sure you should be doing that. Your mother would be pretty upset if she found out. Huh. I don't care. Huh. A for a former Yakuza would do anything to get his daughter back. It doesn't seem too desperate. Oh, no. Um, Dad, I wanted to give you something. Huh? Karen, stop. What do you think you're doing wandering off like that? Yeah. Huh? I told you I was going for a walk and you said okay. <laughs> Well, I must not have heard you right. Come on, Azusa. You really want to go through with taking full custody of Karen in this divorce? I couldn't be more serious. Karen would never reach her full potential with you around. I'm going to raise her right. Aww. Like you have any right to say that. I'm her father and I... Come on, Karen. We need to be getting back to Gen Genda Sensei. Aww. I told you, get a divorce for all I care. What do you think you're doing, young lady? I said, let's go. He sure as hell doesn't hold anything back. Ah. Karen Chan threw something away, didn't she? Ticket to a circus? Was this what she was trying to give her father? I'll hold on to this for, for her until she's calmed down. They're going back to the office, I think. I better get after them. Surprisingly mature kid. I... Uh, I'm not going to say that that's a rule of thumb, but children raised in absentee parent households tend to end up with some kind of weird... Uh, I'm not going to say mental disorders necessarily, but like... I've known some kids whose parents were like never around and they were just like the most functional adult teens I've ever seen. And then I've run into some kids who were sort of raised by their parents, but their parents were never around, and they were just, like, the most spoiled shits ever. Uh, it varies heavily, but, like, I would not be surprised if she isn't kind of being forced to grow up just purely on merit of no one is around to actually raise her properly. Ow. 
Ow. Okay, so I've successfully learned how to fight people, but it seems best to just kick the shit out of them instead of actually trying to use the punch combo, because that just opens me up for harm. Uh, we go for snacks? Let's go over to Smile Burger. Like, the punch combo absolutely hits like a truck. But it opens me up for getting smacked around in the face, which is kind of rough. Okay, so I would like to buy burgers. Good stuff. God, this is making me hungry. Oh, hey you, over there. I don't mean to startle you, startle you, but could you show me your mm -hmm. smile? Huh? Why? Well, we've decided to host an event that fosters friendships between Smileburger and the local community. Allow me to explain. First, each of our guests takes a smile snapshot with one of our smile staff members. Then we'll post that snapshot up on our official smile site. <laughs> and finally, our other customers can go online and vote on who has the winning grin. Simple oh. enough? Wait, you're gonna be uploading our pictures online? Yes? And to compensate for this blatant breach of privacy, the winner gets the first dibs on trying our secret menu. You'll still have to pay for the food, though. So, after forcing us to smile and uploading our pictures online, you still want to take our money. Um, sir? Could you maybe turn that frown upside down? Why not give us a smile instead? Man, all I wanted was a burger. How do I get out of this? Come on, don't be like that. I've been taking a picture with yours truly. The name's Hane... Ane Ida, by the way. Alright, fine. I'm a sucker for a secret menu. Great, then let's get started. We're gonna take this one right out front. <laughs> and let's see that handsome smile. I know, maybe try laughing. How to take a selfie. Open the camera app. Uh, Trouble Yagami, Angry Yagami, Pleasant Yagami, Classic Yagami. Okay, find the right location and lose yourself in the moment and really nail that selfie. Well, it wasn't terrible. My god, his expressions do not change. <laughs> I'm afraid your smile still needs a little work, sir. Are you not a naturally happy person? Nah. Hey, you ask me for my best smile and then you come for my life like that? No frowning, please. Just keep that grin on your chin and look forward to the results. Reg Gami. Smiles for no man. His face doesn't work that way. My god, I just I just clocked you all out. Ah, fine, give me a second. I mean, there we go. I'm properly armed. I want to fight my bicycle. Uh, it broke. Hey, sweet money. That paid for the burgers. Thank you. <laughs> Yagami cares for no car. Obstacles mean nothing to him. Jin, you. Mm -hmm. Aren't you Karen Chan's father? Why are you here? Hmm. Hmm. This place hasn't changed at all. 
Still in desperate need of a cleaning crew. The Kawa, what the hell do you want? Kawa? Oh. That's the father's attorney. I recall, and Genda Sensei's former apprentice. Hmm. No need to be prickly, Genda Sensei. I'm only here to put an offer on the Is table. What? An offer? A settlement. Don't you think these two are capable of an amicable custody decision outside the courts? Hmm. Of course, that would be to everyone's benefit, but. Huh? Hey! I have no intention of handing my daughter over to him. Oh, really? Perhaps you'll reconsider after you see this. Uh, and this. Mm -hmm. How did you get those photos, Okawa? My client suspected his wife might be cheating on him and hired a private investigator. Cheating? That guy was just a salesman. It was nothing lurid. He offered to buy me a drink and I accepted. It was completely innocent. I'm afraid lies don't hold much weight in court, ma'am. Here's a slightly more decisive photo. What? What's going... What's going, Otaki-san? What's this? I don't know anything about that. this. I went home after a few drinks, I swear. I'm afraid the photo is a clear contradiction... Clear contradiction of that, ma'am. Is your memory foggy? According to the PI, you were rather drunk. Th that's... Damn. I admit I wasn't expecting pictures like this to turn up. No, this is a setup. It has to be. A setup? It couldn't be a coincidence that this man appeared right before my trial, and I'm sure his contact info is bogus, too. Besides, I can hold my liquor just fine. I found it strange that I felt so drunk that night. I can only imagine that I was drugged. This is some kind of elaborate trap. Hmm. That's a typical scheme to pull on a guy, but I suppose it would work on a woman, too. Would Aikawa... Wait, Kawa stoop this low. Again. It's just an option on the table that you may want to consider before we go to trial. With evidence like this, I have my doubts your client would win the custody battle. And if we can prove infidelity, we could even end up asking for damages. What are you getting at? Spit it out. <laughs> my client is not heartless, Genda Sensei. Give him full custody and there won't be any damages to pay. As dirty as you've always been, Aikawa. And I'm gonna guess the salesman was part of your plant, or was your plant. Just give my client custody. All she needs to do is sign the newest draft of the divorce papers. Don't you understand, Genda Sensei? You've already lost. Checkmate. Lost. Trials aren't conducted in pieces on a uh, by pieces on a board, Okawa. Says the king, about to be toppled. What's the point of a battle if you aren't out to win? Please, Genda Sensei, I didn't do this. You believe me, don't you? I want to, but... This is a setup. Maybe I can trace it back to some evidence. Seems like it's worth putting in the time. Excuse me. I'm stepping out for a bit, Genda Sensei. Don't let anyone sign any papers mm -hmm. just yet. Yagami? Alright. I should start with the Love Hotel this woman claims she never went to. It's probably in the hotel district. And I can use the photo as reference. Yeah, right, elevators. Yeah. Oh, it's like right over here. Uh, how far? Okay. I know where it is. I kind of mostly vaguely know where it is. God, if somebody did that to me in my car, I'd be freaked out and pissed. However... Okay, so it's somewhere around here. This one. I honestly thought that this was a public bathroom. I mean, I guess it could be construed as such. This is Love Hotel, where that picture was supposed to be taken. Can I help you, sir? Are you here alone? Oh, yeah. You work here? Yes, I'm the receptionist. Oh. 
You're the contacts, right? Mm -hmm. The contacts? Well, it doesn't matter who you are. Give me a hundred thousand yen and I'll delete the footage. Uh, I think you must have the wrong guy. I'm Yagami from Yagami Def Detective Agency. You're a detective. Yeah. yeah, I'm on a case right now, and I'd like to ask a few questions. If I could. Damn it, forget I said anything. I gotta hurry. Hey, old geezer. Oh, there you are. You're late. Wait, this guy. The man in the picture. What do you mean you haven't deleted the security footage yet? I already paid you. You said you'd delete it if I give you the money. Heh, <laughs> sorry, but my pockets seem to have holes in them. Better make it double. Don't screw with me, old man. You delete that shit right now or I'll kill you. Ah! Hey, you know Azusa Taki, don't you? Who the hell are you? Just tell me if you really, if you were really here with Azusa Otaki. Is this business about the security footage related by any chance? Who could say? You can, and judging by the way you're panicking, I'd say that footage is some incriminating evidence, incriminating evidence on you. Gah! The cop uh, told you to make sure it got deleted, but the deal with this old man is starting to fall through. That about the sum of things? Shut up! If you're gonna get in my way, I'll kill you! Wow, really? Now here's the question. Will this work? I'm committed to this. I guess I can kick him. Well, he's on the ground. Here's a question. Does he take more damage if I hit him with the wall? The answer is not really. But that's okay. You know I said earlier how I should probably learn how to fight? <laughs> I'm fine with this. Yeah. Hey, you said you hadn't deleted the footage yet, right? Ha, that's right. We're gonna be worth a nice chunk of change. I was right. Fine, let me buy it off you then. Huh? You mean it? How much are you offering? Depends on the content. If what I need's on there, I'll pay you the full 100k. Oh! Then we have a deal. Let me get it for you. 